You're watching the message. The message. The message. The message. The message. The message. The message network. Our message. Our voice. You're watching the message network. Our message. Our voice. About two years ago, I decided to get some brown paper bags and to write messages on them like, uh, keep your head up and you're not in this alone. Um, you're still valid and significant and important. And um, I love you. And I would go to stores like deals and get individually wrapped food items, things that, you know, can be useful. And I went out after work one night and I just walked around, sat down with different homeless individuals and just asked them how their day was. And I struck up a conversation. It opened my eyes and I learned so much. Giving someone a chance to speak and to tell their truth and to be an attentive listener was such a huge gift to a lot of these people who I consider my friends now. And that's just how it started, food and conversations. I wouldn't be true to myself if I didn't draw on the, on the bag or write, you know, some type of crunchy granola, like very kumbaya quote on the bag that's borderline corny, but you know, it really makes people smile. There's a lot of shame and a lot of stigma that goes along with being homeless. Um, but what people don't realize is that so many of us are literally a paycheck away from being homeless or being hungry or starving. It doesn't take a million dollars to feed the homeless. Having a conversation and shaking someone's hand could save their life. Let's go life in darkness.